Iran's recent unveiling of a hypersonic missile has sent shockwaves through the global military community, raising alarms among its adversaries and sparking intense debates about the balance of power in the Middle East and beyond. This development, marked by the introduction of a missile so advanced that it allegedly cannot be stopped by any current defense systems, represents a significant leap in military technology and a potential game-changer in global security dynamics. The implications of this advancement are profound, not just for the region, but for the world, as it challenges existing defense paradigms and could potentially alter strategic calculations across various theaters of conflict. Before we start, smash the like and subscribe buttons for more updates. The hypersonic missile, unveiled by Iran in a high-profile military ceremony, is reported to travel at speeds exceeding Mach 5, making it one of the fastest and most maneuverable weapons in existence. Unlike traditional ballistic missiles, which follow a predictable parabolic trajectory, hypersonic missiles can maneuver at high speeds within the atmosphere, making them much harder to detect, track, and intercept. This capability is particularly concerning for countries relying on missile defense systems designed to counter conventional ballistic threats. The sheer speed of the missile, coupled with its ability to evade radar and alter its flight path mid-course, renders existing missile defense technologies largely ineffective, raising the stakes for any nation within its range. Iran's announcement of this new missile has been met with a mix of disbelief and concern from the international community. For years, hypersonic technology has been the domain of a select few countries, including the United States, Russia, and China, each of which has invested heavily in developing these cutting-edge weapons. Iran's sudden entry into this elite group suggests that it has made significant strides in its military research and development capabilities, potentially with the help of external partners. The missile's development is seen as a bold statement of Iran's technological prowess and its determination to defend itself against perceived threats, particularly from the United States and Israel. The strategic implications of Iran possessing a hypersonic missile are profound. For decades, Iran has been engaged in a tense standoff with its regional rivals, particularly Israel and Saudi Arabia, both of whom view Iran's military capabilities with deep suspicion. The introduction of a hypersonic missile into this already volatile mix could dramatically shift the balance of power in the region. Israel, in particular, has long relied on its advanced missile defense systems, such as the Iron Dome and the Arrow, to protect against potential Iranian missile attacks. The advent of a missile that can potentially bypass these defenses places Israel in a precarious position, potentially forcing it to reconsider its strategic posture and military investments. Beyond the Middle East, the global implications of Iran's hypersonic missile are equally concerning. The missile's speed and maneuverability mean that it could theoretically reach targets in Europe or even beyond, depending on its range. This has raised alarm bells in NATO, where member states are already grappling with the challenges posed by Russia's and China's hypersonic programs. The prospect of a third player entering the hypersonic race complicates an already complex security environment, potentially triggering a new arms race as countries scramble to develop countermeasures or their own hypersonic capabilities. The missile's development also raises questions about the effectiveness of current non-proliferation regimes. For years, International efforts have focused on preventing the spread of nuclear weapons and ballistic missile technology with mixed results. However, hypersonic technology represents a new frontier in arms control, one that existing treaties and agreements are ill-equipped to address. The speed with which Iran has developed this technology suggests that it may have received assistance from other nations, potentially circumventing international restrictions. This underscores the need for a new approach to arms control, one that takes into account the rapidly evolving nature of military technology and the challenges posed by non-state actors and rogue states. From a technical perspective, the development of a hypersonic missile represents a significant engineering achievement. Hypersonic missiles operate at speeds greater than five times the speed of sound, which presents a host of challenges in terms of materials, propulsion, and guidance systems. The intense heat generated by traveling at such speeds requires advanced heat-resistant materials, while the missile's guidance systems must be able to function accurately despite the extreme conditions. The fact that Iran has been able to overcome these challenges speaks to its growing technical expertise and its ability to innovate in the face of international sanctions and isolation. 
The unveiling of the missile also has significant implications for Iran's domestic politics. The Iranian government has long used its military achievements as a source of national pride and a means of rallying domestic support, particularly in the face of economic difficulties and political unrest. The hypersonic missile is likely to be portrayed as a symbol of Iran's resilience and determination to stand up to foreign adversaries, particularly the United States. This could bolster the government's legitimacy at home, even as it faces growing discontent over economic conditions and the lack of political freedoms. Internationally, the missile's unveiling is likely to exacerbate tensions between Iran and its adversaries, particularly the United States and Israel. Both countries have long been concerned about Iran's missile program, which they view as a potential threat to regional stability and their own security. The development of a hypersonic missile is likely to be seen as a provocative move, one that could lead to a further escalation of tensions and possibly even military conflict. The United States in particular may feel compelled to respond either by increasing sanctions on Iran or by stepping up its own military presence in the region. The missile's development also raises important questions about the role of technology in modern warfare. Hypersonic missiles represent the cutting edge of military technology, combining speed, precision, and maneuverability in a way that makes them incredibly difficult to defend against. As more countries develop these capabilities, the nature of warfare is likely to change, with traditional forms of defense becoming increasingly obsolete. This could lead to a new era of arms races, as countries seek to develop ever more advanced weapon systems in order to maintain their strategic advantage. Iran's hypersonic missile also has implications for the broader Middle East, where rivalries and conflicts have long shaped the region's political landscape. The missile's introduction could exacerbate existing tensions between Iran and its neighbors, particularly Saudi Arabia and the Gulf states, which view Iran's military capabilities with deep suspicion. The prospect of Iran possessing a weapon that cannot be intercepted by current missile defense systems is likely to be seen as a direct threat, potentially leading to a regional arms race as these countries seek to counter Iran's new capabilities. Moreover, the missile's development could have significant implications for the global non-proliferation regime. The spread of hypersonic technology to a country like Iran, which is not a member of the Missile Technology Control Regime, MTCR, could undermine international efforts to prevent the proliferation of advanced missile technologies. This could lead to a further erosion of the global non-proliferation regime, as other countries seek to develop or acquire similar capabilities in response to Iran's advancements. The missile's unveiling also raises important questions about the role of sanctions in curbing Iran's military ambitions. For years, the international community has imposed a range of economic and military sanctions on Iran in an effort to curb its nuclear and missile programs. However, the development of a hypersonic missile suggests that these measures have been largely ineffective in preventing Iran from advancing its military capabilities. This could lead to a reassessment of the effectiveness of sanctions as a tool of international diplomacy, particularly in the face of new and emerging technologies. Iran's recent unveiling of a hypersonic missile represents a significant development in global military technology, one that has far-reaching implications for regional and global security. The missile's speed, maneuverability, and ability to evade existing missile defense systems make it a potentially game-changing weapon, one that could alter the balance of power in the Middle East and beyond. The development of this missile also raises important questions about the effectiveness of current non-proliferation regimes, the role of technology in modern warfare, and the future of international diplomacy in an increasingly complex and multipolar world. As countries around the world grapple with the implications of Iran's new capabilities, it is clear that the global security environment is entering a new and potentially more dangerous phase one in which the traditional rules of engagement and defense may no longer apply. If you like this video, please give it a like and subscribe to our channel. Also, could you leave your comments below and tell us, can any defense system stop this missile? We want to hear from you. Thank you for watching and see you next time.